Welcome aboard LCS-9, the future USS Little Rock. We're currently underway at 40 knots in Lake Michigan on Builder's Sea Trials. Sea Trials are designed to test each of the ship's systems. As a part of this testing, we do a series of high-speed runs like the one you're experiencing now. From this angle, you can see how the LCS rides above the waves like a speedboat thanks to its semi-planing monohull. LCS is one of the fastest ships in the Navy. Powered by a combined diesel and gas propulsion system, the ship's water jets move about 2 million gallons of water per minute. At top speed, the ship produces a wall of water, known as a rooster tail, which rises almost 30 feet above the waterline. LCS-9's flight deck is more than one and a half times larger than that of other U.S. Navy surface combatants. It is capable of accommodating both manned and unmanned helicopters. We're now in LCS-9's pilot house, also known as its bridge. During Builder Sea Trials, the bridge is a hub of activity as engineers test each of the ship's subsystems. During normal operations, only three sailors are required to stand watch thanks to the ship's 8,000 sensors and automated systems. We've now entered the ship's galley and the crew's mess. Four meals a day are produced and served from this space. It's also a place where the crew can relax and enjoy some downtime. The waterborne mission zone is an area unique to the Freedom Variant LCS. With stern doors and a ramp near the waterline, an 11-meter rigid hull inflatable boat can be launched and recovered while the ship is underway in conditions up to Sea State 4. The airborne mission zone is the ship's hangar. It can accommodate two MH-60 Seahawks simultaneously, or one MH-60 Seahawk and up to three UAVs. During sea trials, the airborne mission zone contains the facilities necessary to accommodate the additional test and trials personnel aboard the ship. Located above the airborne mission zone is the helicopter control station. With a view from the flight deck and stern of the ship, the helicopter control tower is used to coordinate aircraft operations. A level above the helicopter control station is the rolling airframe missile launcher, also known as the RAM. The RAM is responsible for protecting the ship from anti-ship missiles and air threats. From this deck, you can look down and see the flight deck as well as the rooster tail. To learn more about the littoral combat ship, go to LockheedMartin.com LCS.